Hello folks all over the world, a new week, a new episode of this series that is enjoying great success in social networks, and for this I thank you so much, we always try to bring selected material. If you are new and like the content, subscribe to the channel and press the bell to receive notifications about new videos. So, are you ready for the new creepy and mysterious clips? Well, let's start immediately with the third position. Ghosts of the Civil War in third place we find a video shot back in February 2009 by the group of paranormal investigators called Living Dead Paranormal, who on their YouTube channel named Foreman04, published a video of an investigation made in Kenton, Ohio, USA. The museum built in 1896 is one of the oldest and most haunted places in the area. It contains relics, documents, objects that belonged to the dead killed during the bloody civil war, it is a place full of history but unfortunately, also of death. Anybody down here? Jesus Christ. Did you see that? Yeah. Time to go. Huh? Where's the Keep going. Wow. What? Yeah. There was a hell of a freaking shadow. It's exact time. Sean and I almost walked into a dark figure, which was about waist high. I almost walked right into it. Is that you? Do we scare you? In the video the group hears noises, voices and some of them say they feel observed. In fact, a frightening face observes them on the ground floor, while on the second floor the figure of a woman crouched on the ground with her legs bent. It is undoubtedly one of the most frightening paranormal investigations recorded in the early days when YouTube was born. In the following years this museum proved to be haunted by other new investigations. If you are interested take a look at the Foreman04 YouTube channel. We mean you no harm. The ghost behind the child. One of the most controversial videos that is causing discussion on the web, is an old video from 2009 posted on Tony Noguera's YouTube channel while he makes a video of his son dancing during the Green Day concert. What appears to be a normal family video, hides something unexpected and disturbing. Look. Dan, look at Liza, go like this. Liza, hey, like this. Liza, look it. Hey. Liza, go like this. Behind the child we see a translucent humanoid figure resembling another child, who observes. Tony's son seems to notice this figure, but since his father is nearby it doesn't matter. The figure seems to disappear a few seconds later, in fact nothing can be seen behind the child. Were you dancing to, uh, some Green Day? Yeah. Dance, go. Yeah. Shake your booty, shake your booty. Shake your booty. Shake your butt. No, don't check your butt, shake your butt. Oh yeah! The 12 year old video is definitely shot in low quality, but for this very reason it makes it difficult to edit or add images. Tony, the child's father and author of the video, says in the comments that he only noticed a few years after posting the video, but can't explain who the figure behind his son was. The case is therefore still open today, and you? What do you think? 
Is it the ghost of another child or a camera error? Write me in the comments below. The Abandoned Factory, Part 11 And it is with great pleasure that we find Bono in first place. Despite having declared the explorations ended due to the great danger of the place, on September 12, 2021 Bono posted on his YouTube channel ILMN Bono Paranormal, the 11th investigation into the old abandoned car factory in Ostrava, Czech Republic. For those who have not seen the previous explorations of Top 3 Ghosts Trapped on Video, it's a factory built 60 years ago and abandoned due to a tremendous explosion of an internal machinery that caused numerous deaths among employees at work. In the previous 10 explorations Bono has seen everything, from paranormal phenomena, to very clear EVPs, poltergeists and object throwing attacks. We now see his return inside the dark and haunted factory. Let's sit back, relax and see what happened. In a video I uploaded like two months ago, I said I wouldn't return to the abandoned factory I was exploring in my first 10 videos for reasons I said in the video, but as it turns out, I found a way to go there anyway. So I'm here, I don't know if you can uh, see everything, but I'm here, I just uh, arrived like a minute ago, I went to this, this is the room with the the chair and so I'm gonna set up one camera here and one in the other room and I don't know see what I can capture because I didn't do this uh, yet so that will be interesting already from the first minutes of exploration Bono detects the first anomaly walk down the corridor ere a black shadow was seen passing through the left door see what happens so I'm gonna put it right here I think and it's the best okay I'm gonna put the camera out here I'm gonna look what the freak was that count immediately fear rises in Bano which tries to understand what has closed the door and analyze the current room something here Uh. No way. Hello? No way. Hello? Bono tries to calm down despite the first oddities and continues the exploration by returning to the room where the two doors locked themselves. But the factory once again demonstrates a lot of activity in fact very sinister noises are clearly heard. I just... <laughs> I probably stepped in a spider web that freaked the shit out of me. Yeah, I stepped in this. <sighs> okay. <laughs> that was the scariest thing. Maybe it wasn't. No way. Hello. Bono goes upstairs, patrolling the rooms with the wardrobes and dressers, and besides the sinister noises, he catches a glimpse of something truly creepy. Plus, I have my camera on that. Hello? Bono decides to lock himself inside a room to try to ask questions to those entities who had opened all the doors of the cabinets and drawers in the previous episode, something truly creepy happens after he asks for a sign of their presence in the room, take a look. This door is closed. No, okay, wait. I'm gonna show you the door. 
There, this is closed. There is no one. Like. Oh my god. I may, I really thought they wanted me to help them, but now they are trying to kill me. Things get worse. Unfortunately, like other times, Bono does not receive the answers to his questions, so he decides to return to the departure room to take away a camera he had left there. This time, however, he suffers a real attack that terrifies him to death. Hello? Yeah, block this so it won't fall. I'm scared of this. Hello? I heard sounds from here. I swear. Hello? So this 11th exploration was much worse than any before. The entities threw two caps at me and even pushed the closet and I don't feel too comfortable going there for another time. But I said I wouldn't return many times before and I still did so I'm not gonna say it this time. So what do you think? Should I return or not? It's on you. Thanks for watching. Fucking hell! I am literally speechless, what do you think? Really a scary exploration out of Bono, the entities are decidedly evil and the place is very dangerous. For today it's all friends, we will follow the updates of Bono in the next episodes, we will see you next week, if you are new and you liked the episode, subscribe to the channel and press the bell for updates. Good night.